Paul Murray were the champions of the world. Celebrated in all the newspapers and even in the music hall. I can't really remember the first time I met Ed Woff. We were talking about local heroes. And I mentioned to him Harry Clasper. Firstly, historically, how important Harry Clasper was, not just to the Northeast, but to uh, racing, boat racing, uh, nationally and internationally. Can we, Harry? Can he lad, Harry? Harry's the king of the Thames and the Tay. He knew about rowing and he put all of that expertise into making him and the people around him the very best that they could be. The legend of rowing, the David Beckham of his time, this little known and yet incredibly famous at the time character from the Northeast. And I encouraged Ed to explore that story a little bit more. It's a great pleasure to, to be doing it with Ed. Um, and the Harry Clasper story. Um, it, it'll fit the stage really nicely. It's a great piece of theatre. It's a really interesting and enjoyable and well-crafted piece of theatre. And one that we're really proud to have um, coming to the Theatre Royal. But I have to tell you, I went to see it and Jamie has brought it to life in such an engaging and compelling way. So he must have been an extraordinary athlete to have won so much so consistently. And our studios at ITV are very close to a pub called The Skiff on the Tyne, um, which has links to Harry Clasper and his family. And that's on Harry Clasper Way. And I figured that this was a name of a guy whose story deserved to be told. And I think what Ed's done with it is absolutely out of this world. Love it. You know, I mean, today he would probably have wiped the floor with most of the athletes. And then, on top of that, the fact that the Bladen races, which, you know, you sing every fortnight at St James's Park, was uh, written for Harry. I think it shows at the end of the day when 130,000 lined the route from his home in the east end of the city to Wickham Cemetery to pay the homage and uh, the respects to such a, a great man. So it's a lovely leap, actually, between bringing the show to the Theatre Royal and the fact that his coffin went past it. Harry's legacy is, is something that should be reawoken. When I went to see it, fantastic. So original, so clever. Um, the design and the direction. You may be going to see it at the Theatre Royal. Um, wherever you go, just make sure you go. He is the greatest and always will be the greatest sportsman the North Easters have ever produced. But you've got to see it.